Glenda, we obtained an email that the school actually sent out to parents this afternoon, and in it, they tell parents that this janitor did not work at the school last year. He currently does not work at the school, but he did work here a few weeks this summer. An 11 year old girl from Prevail Academy spent her summer vacation unlike any of her classmates. She spent it pregnant. She turned 12 over the summer and had the baby just a few weeks ago. That's insane. That's, they're too young. That's crazy. Heather Wallach's cousin attends the same charter school. The alleged father is a former worker, a 28 year old who worked as a janitor through a company that contracts with the school. He's being accused of getting the child pregnant. The teachers are supposed to be more in contact with them because it's a smaller school, and what are they doing? The Macomb County Sheriff says the sexual assault did not happen on school grounds. The man's occupation is the only thing that tied him to the school. That and the fact that the girl's mother had some type of relationship with him. That's insane. Where are the parents? Mommy, can we go? How, how Mommy, does a 12-year-old have a child? Man? There has been no mention of the 12-year-old's father. The girl is still with her mother, but it's unclear if she has her baby or if Child Protective Services took it away. Oh, this is a shop. You know, this is sickening. Both the girl and the man are Mount Clemens residents. Now it was Child Protective Services who contacted the sheriff's department, not the girl's family. And the sheriff tells me that that 28 year old is not in custody, but they do have him scheduled for an interview to come into the sheriff's department. We're live in Mount Clemens, Julie Bonovich, Channel 7, Action News. Really?